Hi, my name's Rachel Andrews. Welcome to Everyday Athlete. On this week's video, I've got three, no, four changing robes to introduce you to. I think the changing robe market is really starting to explode and there really is a lot of choice out there. So I thought I'd bring four that you may not have seen before and uh, have a little chat and go through their features. Before I get stuck into the review of these four coming up, um, I thought I'd just point out that I have done quite a few different changing robe videos and uh, I've got even got a playlist about changing robes which I will link, I'll pop up a little link up here and I'll also stick it in the description below. This is the red pro change robe and uh, it's the long sleeve version. As you can see it comes down to just below my knees and it fits just like a changing robe should, plenty of space in it. Lots of space to get my arms in and rustle about as I should need to. So what are the features then? Well, I've got two very nice and warm pockets which are made of fleece. Um, it's also got a pocket here which has got um, a kind of waterproof coating. So that leads me to believe that would be a good place to leave things that might be at risk of getting wet. Uh, what else have we got? So it's got zips and also this storm flap to do up. And on the inside, it's like a little tiny sheep. So soft. That is really the softest thing I've ever felt nearly. Um, we've got a pocket just inside here, maybe to put your smalls in. And there's some gaps on the side you can see so that then you can stretch it out plenty when you're getting changed really nice quality feeling material and I would say actually you wouldn't look out of place sitting at a beachfront pub in this or even one in the country um, now that we are mostly sitting outdoors it's got a lovely hood not too big and flappy and um, it's also got velcro for the wrists so you could really block out the elements here and feel nice and cosy, which is a little bit much on the first sunny day of the year. Well, this is the Gorilla Robe, um, a UK company that's just started up in the last couple of years. And this is their second version of the Gorilla Robe. So, starting from the top, lovely spacious hood there. Ooh, which I'll get off. It does have some drawstrings where I could pull it in a little bit tighter should I need a little bit more warmth. It's got velcroing um, wrists to seal out the weather. Again, quite warm today, so I'll just undo that for ventilation. Uh, pockets wise then, we've got a double pocket here. So this one, we've got a, a fairly deep one which is just a straight up open pocket uh, at the front, fleece lined and does up with velcro and then either side of that, underneath it, we've got the second pocket which zips um, and joins up and I'd say that's where in the winter you might want to pop a little hot water bottle keep your hands uh, and uh, start to warm your belly up a little bit that would be quite nice also with the zips, that would be the place to put any valuables so it's not a waterproof pocket but it is a secure one Okay, what else have we got? Well, let's have a little word about the lining. So this is super nice and warm. Really nice warmth and fluffy. Feels a little bit like cuddling a lamb, I would say. Um, nice length on it. Comes down past my knees. And if I put my arms inside, this is the M size. And I'm around about a size 16-ish. Uh, um, and again, plenty of space should I want to get changed. Now, a little extra feature on this one is they've thought about the struggle that you might have if you're dealing with a wetsuit. So, we've got zips on either side. So you can really open it up while you've got your top, top half nice and warm. And then you can deal with whatever you need to deal with down here, which can be a bit of a struggle inside the changing robe. 
So uh, thumbs up to that one, Gorilla Rope. Nice touch, nice interesting innovation there. So, you can undo this. A little bit of ventilation or do it right up for a bit more warmth. Looking on the inside, there's no extra pockets in here. Um, and this one comes in at under 90 pounds, which I think is a bargain. Nice colour too. Now this one is the sitting suit, sent to me by North Supply. And it is a long one, look at it. Really nice and long. So this, unlike the others, is not a traditional changing robe. It doesn't have a fleece lining, um, but it is nice and big. The idea is that you can sit outside. Um, I'm guessing this, uh, this comes from its Nordic heritage. And, um, but there is certainly enough room to get and change inside it. So that's quite interesting, isn't it? So it's kind of a large coat um, under which you probably need a towel to dry off. It's got these big pockets here, or holes, so that you can access your own pockets, which is quite a nice feature. Or I guess if you're getting changed, maybe pull your knickers up if you're wearing them. So there's no extra pockets on the inside. Um, so it really is a kind of overcoat, which given how, um, I want to say fluffy, it's not really fluffy, but um, it feels like there's a lot of insulation and uh, I can't feel any wind on me at all at the moment. And I think this would be cracking, especially for hanging out on the beach afterwards or sitting and having your, uh, your cup of tea and, and cake or maybe even hanging out at the pub. Um, they do lots of different colours um, and uh, this is just one of them. So they, they're from about £90 upwards. Let's take a look at that hood. Wowzers, by far and away the biggest hood but it does have some pull cords so that you can really wind it in. Could certainly fit my bubble hat in underneath this one. No problem at all. I really like the extra length on this one. Um, because sometimes that can be the bit that gets cold and I think you could easily use this uh, with not too much on underneath but remembering those gaps for your return journey and especially if you had to stop off at the supermarket on the way back. At this time of year it's not absolutely necessary to have a weatherproof changing robe like the previous ones we've looked at there. This is Gorilla Robe's recycled changing robe so it is made of a minimum of 15 um, one litre plastic bottles. So that's quite cool, quite an interesting concept. Um, so it's not waterproof, but I would imagine it's quick dry. It has a little kind of kangaroo pouch at the front. As you can see, it's got the, um, the hood. What I like about it as a, as a light changing robe is that it's got arms. So uh, less of the boob flashing when you're getting changed, which is good. It also has some pockets a little bit like the sitting suit there which come in these are pockets that are just a hole where you can get in and uh, either help with your getting changed or get something out your pocket if you needed to from your clothes underneath so that's a really nice touch these come in a number of uh, different uh, colors and styles and uh, it's worth checking out on their website but really nice to see an interestingly um, patterned piece of recycled material so this is a, a very interesting and really quite nice and warm I'd say it's probably about the same weight as um, a microfiber towel maybe so it's really quite nice and light and uh, really very soft on the inside if you've seen any of my other changing row videos you'll know I do like to check if the changing robes will fit into my 28 litre tow float so that's the test I'm going to do next
I was really pleased to see that they all fitted easily inside of my Zone 3 28 litre um, dry, dry bag tow float. Um, for me, that is something that's critical in a changing road. For many others, it won't be. But I like to do one-way swims or perhaps if I'm doing a training swim and I'm doing an out and back and I'm swimming for quite a long time, I like to know that if I wanted to, I could just get out, get a changing robe on and, uh, and I'll be warm enough to get myself back to my car. All of the changing robes that I've tried today, the red, the gorilla robe, the sitting suit and the other gorilla robe are all made of 100% polyester some of which are recycled so the lining or the um, padding of the sitting suit is recycled as is uh, the entirety of the recycled change robe from Gorilla. There's a vast range in terms of price and features across all changing robes so it's certainly worth trying on other people's changing robes and seeing what suits you. Think about whether it's important that it fits into uh, a tow float whether you want to take it on an adventure or whether in actual fact it's stylish enough for you to be able to feel happy to take it out and sit in a pub outdoors just in case we get another of those uh, pesky half lockdowns. I hope you've enjoyed this week's video and if you have you'll give it a like let me know what your favourite changing robe is or what you're considering if you've got any questions about them I've tried on quite a few now so I might have an answer for you Please consider subscribing to my channel by clicking on my face, dinging the little bell, and uh, then you'll know when the next one's out. And I'll see you next time. Bye.